guys so we are at the nile coffee shop it is a must when you come to the phoenix mesa area it is downtown mesa arizona um it is vegan it is all things yummy if you're a coffee person so one of my checks off check off on my to-do list while here in arizona let's go guys so we had a great time being with daddy he had one client today so he's gone to do that i was able to lay down um but now i'm trying to go on ahead and make a list um put anything in my amazon um registry that we need um and just make out what we're wanting to do to finish up this rv being that we're going to keep her and we're trying to just get done with all renovations because we want it to be done we want everything to have a place and we are wanting to be able to just enjoy the adventure and not really like at, at some point i mean like when is the renovations gonna stop so um yes so currently you guys know that i repainted this we did decide to go ahead and get a tv for here eventually because i'm getting tired of when i want to like do my nails or do a facial i have to take my tv out of my room and put it in here and hubby's like you're going to mess the mount up so we're just going to get um some kind of tv something inexpensive to go right here eventually we're gonna get firsting up the pillow covers on these pillows uh, we're gonna get the floor redone this part of the floor needs to come completely out and a whole new one in and then the kids slide that whole slide floor need to come out and new floor go down and then we're going to build three bunks so two bunks and a trundle which will be judah so if he fall out the bed he already on the floor it don't matter i realized i had taco sauce on my shirt but i come here to say this is white and this is brown don't worry about the mess this is brown i think this needs to be repainted i don't think it's matching anymore i think this is giving updated vibes and we were doing my room and we're finna put new flooring down in my room and i'm probably gonna go ahead and brighten that up too i'm probably gonna end up taking all the brown out um so i'm thinking this needs to be done as well but what color? I don't think it should be white. I think it should be something bright and light colored, but I don't think white. So what do you think um, the color of the kitchen area should be? Because it is still, even though it's one room, it's still its own area, if that makes sense. All right, comment below. Let's keep it going. Shalom, guys. Welcome to a new day in our vlog. So a couple things. We're starting renovations on the RV because as you guys know we decided to keep it so whether buying an rv or spending a maybe i don't know what our budget is but we to help you said we do have to get a budget to get the house to be a little more comfortable a little more functional that's where we're starting on and we want to be done before we leave arizona which is in four weeks because once we hit the road we only want to just think about whenever hubby, hubby do have to work and enjoying the journey not always paying some and breaking out some and buying some else we want our money to go towards, of course, keeping the bills paid, but adventure and saving. Not really more into the house. I mean, like, let's get this done already. So, it is Wednesday, and today I'm going to be taping off the kitchen area because we're going to be painting this side because it's, so let me show you. So, it's a mess, so 
we're not looking at what's on the counter we're looking at the color of the cabinets so of course this side looks nice and spacious because it's a nice bright color and then over here it looks kind of dark and dated so i'm at the point where let's just paint it how we say it as long as he ain't got to paint it so it's up to me <laughs> but i am a homeowner so let's get this done um i don't know if you already looked but in the community tab of our channel there is voting um so i was looking thinking about those colors but a little lighter um but not too light because children you got to think about so many factors when choosing choosing paint color when you have so many children it's got are you playing your flute judah mm -hmm. sounds so great what tori doing hi mommy she ain't got no clothes on let's not put her on camera um yes so that's where our, our plan is today clean the bathroom tape off what we want to tape off for the painting painting cabinetry is difficult it's, it's time consuming but it gotta get done so also in other news hubby and i want to lose some weight i feel a little sluggish and i don't feel my best i want to lose 10 pounds before june 1st but i don't know but we'll see and hubby don't let someone lose weight but he does want to do better on his sugar intake and make sure his digestion is a little better than what it's been and so come along with those two journeys with us as we continue to have adventures um weight loss better health eating and renovations all right family so of course it's a little dark in here because we cover these windows with reflectors okay we're not trying to get hot or overwork our air conditioner in this arizona heat anyway so today on the agenda while hubby is at work we still don't have the van back from the whole testimony yet but uh, yeah i still i'm sure working on something so we're gonna leave that to him and i have decided to go on ahead and paint these this side of the kitchen let me go into some light there you go i have decided to go ahead and paint this side of the kitchen and then of course during painting i need to fix that trimming there um so today bathroom clean the bathroom do some more laundry um tape off what needs to be painted and homeschooling and stay alive so let's get going all right family so we're making some oatmeal we got cucumber and lemon cut so what we do with our water here in arizona which we'll probably just adapt no matter where we go is we put cucumber it's in everybody's cup and we put some lemon juice and a little bit of pink himalayan salt it allows us to stay hydrated so the salt is supposed to help your cells absorb the water instead of just running through your body it actually absorbs in your system because we have dry heat here so i got their waters made and we are doing some oatmeal with brown sugar and granola and then we're going to start on schoolwork i'm gonna get them set up with schoolwork while they're doing schoolwork i'm going to start taping off some of the things here um to prep it for priming for the week and then hopefully we'll be done painting by sunday so that's what we're doing oh and we were doing bottled water because arizona water is nasty but we're tired of wasting plastic and buying water so we're going to go back to the berkey and just drink cold water and keep flavoring it with fruits and that's how we're going to work that all right all right so they're eating their oatmeal normally i'm not i don't use regular bowls i use paper bowls but we ran out so i'm gonna place an order for some paper bowls but they're eating their oatmeal and some fruit more fruit they had strawberries earlier once they're done they take these and then they all have their water so yep that's what we're doing let me show you guys what i take so in normally i'll take my collagen booster which helps with a lot of things definitely look it up i take my moringa every morning because it definitely gives me exactly what my body needs because i don't like to take sea moss and um i take my holy basil at night but if i feel like i need more i'll take me some chlorophyll i'll take um my vitamin d my zinc and more vitamin c but for the most part this does it so yeah that's what your girl be talking okay, about. So I've done nothing I was supposed to do today. I've done everything else. I've been busy, but I ain't did no no taping. I ain't cleaned the bathroom. I ain't washed my hair. But they did the schoolwork, so yay. So 
in the community tab one two of the options was like a sage or like a blue uh, but i think i'm gonna do more of a gray because of what color this is and i don't plan on painting this so i think we'll do more of a gray that could possibly tie this end over here and keep up here white to keep this part of the rv open since we do have a low ceiling and take this on gray and change the hardware out to black to kind of tie in judah just yelling the uh the faucet and all that good stuff so. I will wash some dishes, but I'm not. I wash them tonight. And I think I'm changing this out. Um, so yeah. And I think I'm gonna put curtains there. Something to give it a more home feel. So yeah, that's what we're looking at. All right, guys. Just keeping you guys updated. I'm gonna drink my water. Make them some corn dogs. And I will lay the carpet for just my little room, my little section. And I like this, but this with the thickness of this was not ideal with having little kids um, trying to keep it clean. So even though I like that color, I'm gonna try to do it with this, but with a shorter hair, so it's easier to get stuff out there. Cause we're not gonna we're not gonna be able to get a big vacuum. I mean, we have nowhere to put it. So I'm still thinking about these colors, but this is for the kitchen. And I'm leaning towards this actually. I'm leaning towards this. Cause we can add green with plants. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> we do have a lot of plants though. I want more plants. So yeah, so I think we're gonna do this. Now, if we, we're not gonna do carpet in the kids' room. We were thinking about it cause it's super, super cheap. But if they waste anything, it's a wrap. So we're gonna do some flooring in their room. All right, give that guys. Shalom. People. We're going to attempt to finish painting today. That'll never work out, but we're going to try it again. So, task is hubby don't have a two clients today. So, we're going to try to finish my painting in my room. At least start on painting in the living room. I mean, the kitchen living room area. So, this part is really nice and bright. And I think it makes this look kind of outdated, even though it's a nice, rich brown. I kind of want to just open the whole space up completely. Um, so, we're going to try to get this painted. Whatever. I'm going to start. I'm going to take a shower real quick. We're going to start out with some fruit for everyone. Give them like an hour or two. Maybe make some oatmeal. Whatever. And, yeah. I'm trying to start, start to eat better, like more fruits and veggies less pancakes in the mornings like it's getting old it's, it's not healthy um let me get myself together I'll so we are getting started we're gonna try to get this section done and we're gonna try to get the room painted so how you starting out by taking the doors off i'm gonna start off by trying to clean up the surrounding areas make sure the children are fed and start taking the sheets off my bed and clearing the area so paint won't just get everywhere. All right, let's guys. Get going. So, hubby is taking the doors, all the doors off. I'm gonna start taking some of the things off of my room, and I'm gonna get started with the room and let that coat be drying while I help um, in the living room. So, in between nursing and telling kids to stop, but we're gonna get this done because it got to get done. Let's do it.
but we are I'm gonna have to find a new edge control. Comment below what you okay. use to lay your edges down that doesn't have this white film. Okay, next. Anyway, so we have started doing the top paint in the kitchen. The bottom part is gonna be a different color. So I'm not gonna even open that up right now because if you have five kids in a small place, you can't do all that at one time. And you still gotta feed them and nerves and all that. And we got this part of the room started. So we're gonna stop what we're doing. We were going to cook, but they turned the water off here at the RV park because they're fixing the water meters or something. And then, nope, had nothing to do with Pooja. Um, so they're doing that. So we have no water. Water is not on. So all the dirty dishes are still sitting or whatever. So we're gonna go get some lunch, feed this handsome young man, and go get the van. She's fixed, hopefully. So we're gonna go do that. And then he got two clients, so I don't wanna overwork him, so we're, he's done for today. I'm gonna start back up when I get back, maybe. Um, I do wanna finish at least to where I can put the doors back. Ooh, but I probably still cannot. I probably still can't, at least in my room. Anyway, if not, we'll just leave it as it is and lay down and start back again tomorrow. But that's where we are right now. So we're going to go get some to eat, go get the van. He's going to go to work. I'm probably going to go get a few groceries, maybe do some laundry, and maybe do them some school work. All right, let's go. Backsplash off. We're going to throw it away. And the other doors are drying. It's super hot out here, so it shouldn't take long. We are here. Picking baby girl up. She's so dusty, but I can't wait to see how she drives. See if she's ready for more adventure. All right, let's go in. Yeah, we got bubbles back. She's back alive Yay. once again. She never once made it. again. Yay. Bubbles is back. All right, start it up. Yeah, make sure she start up. Make sure she run. Yeah, she's dusty. She need a good washing. Yeah, I'm gonna put the license plate back on real quick. Okay, all right. Well, see, about to, was about to sell my baby. So, <laughs> they they wiped some of the stuff off so that they know she was not up for auction. They took all our stuff out. All of our stuff was in plastic bags because she was gonna get sold. Um, I took the license plate off, everything. So she's really dirty. Now, I don't know what happened did they have her just left open or what but she is dirty so hopefully we can get it detailed before we leave arizona but i'm sure the children are waiting to get back in their seats so let's get them out of daddy's van and get them back in bubbles all right guys so we got the van back as you saw so you know first up first sorry sorry <laughs> so we came to target because the children had have a couple of clothing that they either have torn, uh, stained, grew out of. Um, so we were able to bring them back to Target because they're a cat and Jack, and they gave us a gift card to go back more clothes. So we're gonna go get the kids a couple more items of clothing, and yeah, that's what we're gonna do. And then we're gonna get some, uh, go to the grocery store, get daddy some veggies and some potatoes. Go back home, do another coat of paint, it's a lot. I don't even think I'm gonna get all this done today, but let's see because i kind of want to go to the park and watch the sunset so we'll see what we end up doing uh why daddy is doing his two clients for today all right let's keep this day going so we actually ended the vlog here we just ended the day off thank you again for watching another butler's unbox video letting us into your home every week just to share our adventures of tiny living through torah don't forget, we are renovating the RV. If you would like to send any tokens of love, that is in the description box below. Also, our Amazon registry for anything that we're needing as well. Thank you again. Toda Rabah. May the Most High bless you and be with you. Shalom, guys.